What's up, everybody? Andrew Mahone here. Oh my gosh, with my good friend Sean Lydon. So oh, no, Sean no. is here, and he has brought us some super sweet stuff to open for our one of every Pokemon product series. Sean, tell me what we got here. So this is a Korean base set. So this is basically Korean Evolutions. Uh, comes with four packs. You got a cool giant Charizard, a regular sized Charizard. Um, so we're hoping for some cool stuff today. All right. So do we know? Anything about the Korean cards? Are these like, do we, they have organized play in Korea? Do you know anything about any of this? So they have their own Korean organized play. Okay. Yeah. But they don't, do they go to the world championships? Uh, they do. I believe you have to be a resident of Korea to get uh, championship points and all that. Oh, okay. So that is, uh, that's something I've looked too much into. Interesting. Because I've seen some more of these like Korean, you know, uh, lettering here uh, on some cards. And I, I've just seen them around, like obviously making their ways through like bulk and stuff. And I always snatch them up when I see them because I think they just look super cool and very different. Obviously, like, you know, Korean, Korean is, uh, you know, very, very unique uh, writing there. So very cool. You can definitely tell it's not uh, Japanese and it's not Chinese. So that is That's, a, I, it's, I like it's something. Yeah. Yeah, it's very, very, very cool. Yes, yeah, it's very aesthetically pleasing. I can't read a lick of it, but it is definitely <laughs> sweet. So, all right, Sean, I'm going to let you get to cracking this thing. All and right. uh, since this is out of your own collection here and show us what we got. It appears to be taped there. Yeah, so very cool. Looks like we got a giant card in here. And a Charizard All right. EX. All right, first of all, let's all take right. that guy let's out, of that out of there. Yep, so Charizard EX, Korean. Uh, it's got the good old bendy bend to it. Check that guy out. Yes, very warped, but nonetheless, we're going to put that boy in a sleeve. Very cool. And then, awesome, what is that? This giant Charizard is awesome. So this is a promo in an English uh, red and blue box set, so... Is it? So this is... uh it looks awesome as an oversized card. Yeah, so we don't have the jumbo version in English, do we? I don't think so. Uh, the European versions have it. Oh, can't okay. have a toy inside of the box. Actually. Oh, the European versions don't have toys in their boxes. They do not, no. Really? I did not even know that. Okay, so that's super interesting, but we don't have it stateside then. Nope, not stateside. Awesome. I'll bring and some German the, stuff uh, over one day. The cool magmar up there in the corner. That is awesome. This is some fantastic artwork here. And I love the gold border. I just think gold. Oh, Flareon. Didn't even see Flareon down there. Super sick. Very, very cool. All right, so we got the jumbo card. And then we got, what, two, three, four packs. Four here. packs. All right. All right, so let's see. I think you get two and then I get two. That seems that's about fair, right? Down. Okay, so let's uh, do red versus blue. Let's, uh, all right, yeah, yeah. We'll, a tab we'll do here. we'll do greens, and then we're going to do red versus blue. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, there's a tab. Uh, that yeah. is neat, so check that out. We've got a little huh. a little way to rip the pack out. This packaging is very loose. Oh, they feel so weird. Compared to, stock. oh, my gosh. And then the back is English, so that is funny. Mm. Uh, are, is that oh. the way it is with uh, most uh, most foreign cards, except for Japanese? Is the back is English on all of them, I would assume, right? As far right? as I know, yeah. Yeah, yeah, all, okay. Yeah. And I guess I was expecting it to look different because this looks Japanese-esque, right? It does. So yeah, I was expecting like a, and... yeah, but the car stock and everything. All right, very cool. So we got Magmar. Energy. Energy. Oh, Kakut. Are we, oh, okay, oh, we were we matching the there for a program, while. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Yeah, Magikarp. Electabuzz. Coughing. Farfetched. Uh, oh, uh, Spirit double Link. Colorless double colorless. Let's see, where's our, oh, sick. Oh, wow. Check that out. We've got a Hitmonchan. Oh, very cool. Very, very cool. Now, is this the equivalent of, like, our Evolutions? Is that... So, yeah, their base set was Evolutions, basically. Okay. Oh, their very first set yes. was Evolutions. Okay, so this kind of is their... For 20th anniversary of Pokemon, this is yep. their first Korean set, right? Okay, awesome. No, So it is their base set. That's interesting. I was wondering why it says, like, base pack, you know? That's, uh, that's awesome, though. So cool stuff. So for Pokemon's 20th anniversary, they went to Korea. All right, Red versus Blue. Stuff. Red versus Blue. Let's see how we do here. Oh yeah, and look at look at that. That's cool. They got all the energy symbols there on the back of the pack. Show that off a little bit. Whole bunch of warnings here. Not for three year olds apparently that I cannot read. <laughs> <laughs> and let's see how we do in this one. I love the evolutions artwork. It's super sick. Very cool. All right, we got a Vulpix and a Ponyta. Energy, Tangla, Nidoran, Machop, Rattata, Switch. Last way, Spears Lady. Oh, you got the, uh, okay, so very cool. Rare, yeah. A Haunter. Oh, I, I think it's so. You got a Magneton. Oh! We got Charizard! Oh, yeah. We're going to put that boy in a sleeve. The red definitely won. Go that ahead. One. Uh, yes, the red did win. Oh, we got the hitter. going to put it in upside down. That's how all the pros do it, right? Yep. 
So very cool. Check him out. Look oh, at your yeah. uh, riff there. Good. Yeah. yeah, that's an awesome. I mean, that very unique card. I feel like it's pretty hard to get. I mean, I think so too. Yeah. Holographic Korean Charizard. I mean, great for any collection. Sean's a big time collector. He's got a huge collection of Charizard stuff and just uh, old card stuff. So that is awesome. And that that card. I mean, it has to be. And it has to be like one of a kind. I mean, not one of a kind, but like for your collection, anyways. That's the uh, yeah, first <laughs> Korean uh, Charizard that I have. So awesome stuff. Anyways, uh, thank you to Sean Lydon for allowing us to open this Korean base set box. This was awesome. It was just an amazing experience. And we even got a sick pull out of it. That is fantastic. So anyways, let us know. What do you guys think of this, uh, this pack opening in the comments below? Make sure to like the video, sub to the channel. Peace.